Praise the living Jesus. My name is Ariel Laure Lua, the prayer coordinator of this online prayer ministry, and this is Praying Eagles Network. Praying Eagles Network. Praying Eagles Network is an online prayer ministry where we fellowship together online to seek the face of the Almighty God in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ with the help of Holy Spirit. Coming live from Lagos State, Nigeria, I know that as you join us today, as we fellowship together, as we pray together, to seek the face of the Almighty God, the Lord will arise and intervene on that matter. According to Luke 21, verse 13, we say, He shall turn to you for a testimony. That matter, that marital matter, that financial matter, that emotional matter, that matter concerning your business, concerning your career, concerning your health, concerning your loved one, it shall turn to you today for a testimony in the name of Jesus. I pray for you, sir. I pray for you, ma. One more time. That that matter, this very day, the Lord will turn it to you for a testimony in the name of Jesus. So why not sit down, get ready for a defined encounter, for a life transforming testimony. You are welcome, Jesus' name. God. Praise the living Jesus. Amen. Good morning, sir. Good morning, man. You are welcome to another beautiful day in the presence of the Almighty God. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus. Let's lift up our hand this morning and bless the name of our Lord, our God, for another beautiful day. Let's lift up our hand this morning and worship the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the Alpha, the Omega. The Lord God has sustained you. The Lord God has sustained me. The Lord God has sustained our life. Let's lift up our hand and say thank you, Jesus. Today is Monday, the beginning of another working week. Let's lift up our hand and appreciate him. Let's lift up our hand and say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. 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 I want you to lift up your hand and worship him. Lift up your hand this morning and appreciate him. Lift up your hand this morning and bless his holy name. He is worthy to be praised. He is worthy to be praised. Our Lord is good. The Bible says, for his mercy endure forever. For the mercy of God that preserve you, for the mercy of God that preserve my life, can we all lift up our hand and worship the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the Alpha, the Omega, the beginning and the end. Our Lord, our God, our hope, our sustainer, our defender. Lift up your hand and say thank you, Jesus. For preservation of life, say thank you, Jesus. For the Lord God that preserve your life, that preserve your home, that preserve your marriage, that preserve your business, that preserve your career. For the Lord God that preserve that works of your hand. Why not just say thank you, Jesus? Thank you, Father. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name, we have given thanks. We slept last night and we wake up this morning for the Lord God sustain you. For the Lord God sustain me. For this, let's lift up our hand and appreciate our Lord, our God, who sustain us, who sustain our life, who did not allow the power of the grave to swallow us up, who did not allow the power of the night to swallow us up? Why not just lift up a hand and appreciate him? Why not just lift up a hand and say, thank you, Jesus. Father, we worship you. We give you praise. 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 Lord, we say thank you. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your holy name. Thank you for not allowing the power of the night to swallow us. Thank you for not allowing the will and the agenda of the enemy to come to pass over our life. Father, we say thank you. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. To God be the glory. In Jesus' name, we are giving thanks. Now, lift up your hands. Say, Father, say this morning, as I have come before you, say I declare open heaven upon my life, upon my business. Open heaven. Open heaven. Say, I declare open heaven this morning upon my life in the name of Jesus. Can you begin to declare open heaven? Let heaven open upon you. Open, open heaven upon you.
upon your business, open heaven upon your career in the name of Jesus. As you are preparing to go to work this morning, as you are preparing to go to work this day, say, I declare open heaven in the name of Jesus. Open heaven in the name of Jesus. Open heaven upon the work of my hand. Open heaven upon my business. Open heaven upon my career. Father, let heaven of ease, heavens of ease, heavens of ease, heavens of profitable says, let it open upon me this morning in the name of Jesus. Upon the work of my hand, let heaven open in the name of Jesus. Let heaven open in the name of Jesus. Let heaven open in the name of Jesus. I decree, I declare, my Lord, my God, open heaven. Open heaven, 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 upon the work of my hand this morning, in the name of Jesus, upon my business this morning, in the name of Jesus, upon my career this morning, open heaven, in the name of Jesus. I want you to decree and declare, let heaven open upon your business this morning, in the name of Jesus. Upon the work of your hand, let heaven open. Upon your business, let heaven open. Can you begin to decree and declare open heaven in the name of Jesus? Lord, let heaven open. Let it 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 open. Let heaven open. Upon the work of our hand, in the name of Jesus. Open heaven. Open heaven. Open heaven. Open heaven. Open heaven. Open heaven, open heaven, open heaven, open heaven. Thank you, mighty Father. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name, we have decreed. Sweet Holy Spirit, we invite you to our midst this morning. We ask that you ask your, you have your way. In Jesus' name, praise ye the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Good morning, sir. Good morning, man. You are welcome to another beautiful morning. My name is Ariola Oreolua, the prayer coordinator of this online prayer ministry, and this is Praying Eagles Network. Wherever you are, wherever you are logging in from, wherever you are joining us from, you are welcome in the name of Jesus. By the special grace of God, every Monday morning, every Monday morning, 5 o'clock Nigeria time, 5 a.m. Nigeria time, every Monday morning, we come online to pray for our business. You are a business owner, you are a career person, amen. You resume, you have a work you to do, you are an online business person, praise the Lord, as long as you have something that you are doing for a living. Or you are believing God for a job, every morning by the grace of God, every Monday morning, 5 o'clock Nigeria time, we come online to pray for our business together just for 30 minutes, praise the Lord. And uh, the theme for the prayer is, my business my must prosper my business must prosper can you say it say my business must prosper say the work of my hand will prosper praise the lord and the anchor scripture for monday business prayer meeting is taken from psalm 90 verse 17. please can you write it down psalm 90 verse 17. as you go to that office this morning as you go to that your business this morning, as you resume back to that office this morning, hear me, sir, hear me, man. Every school owner, every business owner, this is what is going to happen in that your business, in that your school, in that ministry. Those of us that are pastor, in that ministry, in that church, this is what is going to happen in that church, in that ministry. Psalm 90. Verse 17. If I am going to be you, I will write it down. Every morning, not only this Monday morning, every morning, anytime you resume to that office, that is what you are going to chant. Praise it, the Lord. By the grace of God, anytime I enter into the office, every blessed day, this is the scripture, the first prayer I pray, the first a scripture that I recite there. Praise the Lord. Psalm 90, verse 17. What do we have there? 
Have you opened it, my sister? Have you opened it? Okay, if you have opened it, let's read it together. And let the beauty of the Lord our God be upon us, and establish thou the work of our hands upon us. Yea, the work of our hand establish thou. Is that what you have in your Bible? Can we take it again? And let the beauty of the Lord our God be upon us, and establish thou the work of our hands upon us. Yea, the work of our hand establish it. Another version says, let the glory, where you have the beauty, the beauty there, talk about the glory of God. He said, yea, let the glory of God, our Lord, our God, be upon us. Praise it, the Lord. When the glory of God is upon you, when the glory of God is upon that your business, it will begin to attract. It's like magnet. It's like light. In the night, when you enter into an environment and the whole place is dark, anyone, any place, any spot where you have light, that, pl- that point, that place will attract all eyes unto them. Praise it, the Lord. Am I right? You enter into a location or uh, the whole streets are dark, but there is one particular house that is that, that have light. From far away, you will notice the house. From far away, you will see it. Praise the Lord. That is the beauty of the Lord. That is like the glory of the Lord. When the glory of God is upon your business this morning, hear me, sir, hear me, ma. From far, from near, it will attract buyers. It will attract customers into your business. The glory of the Lord. The beauty of the Lord. The light of the Lord. Can we now take it together now with understanding? Let the beauty of the Lord our God be upon us and establish thou the work of our hands upon us. Yea, the work of our hand establish it. When the beauty of the Lord is upon thy business, when the glory of the Lord is upon thy business, when the light of God radiates upon thy business, you and I know that your business is established. You and I know it's a matter of time before you know it. There will be increase, there will be enlargement in that your business because of the glory of God, because of the light of God, because of the favor of God, because of the beauty of God. You have a small shop, you have a small small business that you are running and the beauty of the Lord is upon it and the glory of the Lord is upon it and the light of God is upon it. The next thing, it will draw customer to you, it will draw customer to that business. And there will be what? There will be high demand of your product and service. When there is high demand of your product and service, what will happen? Increase. Enlargement. Because you will no longer be able to manage it alone. That business, you will no longer be able to do what? Handle it alone. Because of the high demand of your product. Because of the high demand of your service. What is the next thing you need to do? You need to employ people. Before you know it, you employ the first person, the second person, the first ten, the second ten, the first hundred. Praise it, the Lord. Before you know it, that your location, you are not able to manage it there because that place will be too small. And what's going to be the next thing? You have to go and look for another place. You are not closing it down. You are looking for another bigger place where you'll be able to enlarge. This is going to be a portion this very week in the name of Jesus. So do you all now understand the scripture? So lift up your hand. Say, oh Lord my God. Say this week, according to Psalm 90 verse 17, let your beauty, let your glory, let your honor, let your light rest upon me and upon my work. In the name of Jesus, can we begin to declare and declare upon Prayer Goods Network, oh Lord my God, let your beauty, let your glory, let your light Rest upon it in the name of Jesus, upon the work of my hand, upon my business, upon my career, upon myself, upon my office, the beauty of God, the glory of God, the light of God, let it rest in the name of Jesus. Can you pray that prayer? Let the beauty of God, the glory of God, let it rest upon your business in the name of Jesus. See upon the work of my hand, 
Oh Lord my God, let your beauty, let your glory, let your honor rest upon my work in the name of Jesus, upon the work of my hand, upon my business, the beauty of God, the glory of God, the honor of God, the light of God, let it rest in the name of Jesus. Can you declare and declare the beauty of God, the glory of God, the honor of God, let it rest upon my business, upon my career, upon my business, upon my career, upon my business, upon my career, upon my business, the beauty of God, the glory of God, the honor of God, the light of God, upon myself, upon my business, upon my career, in Jesus' name we are praying. Let's take the remaining scripture down. You can go over them on our own at our spare time so that we can pray. We only have 30 minutes this morning. And um, Proverbs 22 29. Proverbs 22 29. Proverbs 16 18. Deuteronomy 8 18. Psalm 84, verse 11, Daniel 5, 17. I take it again. Proverbs 22, 29. Proverbs 16, verse 3. Proverbs 22, 29 says, Seest thou a man who is diligent in his business, he shall stand before kings, he shall not stand before mean men. You are, go you are getting ready to go to work this morning. Which means that is part of diligence. You don't joke with your business. You don't play with your business. God is giving you assurance that before you know it, you will stand before kings. Amen. Praise the Lord. When people begin to troop in, you know the glory of God is already on your business. The light of God is already there. The beauty of God is already there, which attracts people. And the more the, uh, that glory attracts people, amen, what will happen? The king, the honor people, the, the celebrity, amen, what else, what else, what else, those people there, they begin to take notice, you remember, um, um, uh, what's the name, uh, the name of this man, that they took the ark of God into his house, Me, eh, Mephibosheth, Obedidon, thank you, you remember Obedidon, the Bible said they took the ark of God into his house, within three months, God prosper him, God prosper all his household, Everything that concerns him, God prosper them. Before you know it, his neighbor, this man always comes to us to borrow uh, food, to borrow this, to borrow that. He's not borrowing again. This man did not have a car. Now, this man have one. I have the second one. The wife have a car. The children are changing uh, dresses. Oh, they are looking good. They are looking, they are buying new things. Praise the Lord. Before you know it, the town people begin to know because they know this man. This man always work, but this time around, he's changing car. If he's going out in the morning with one car, if he's going out in the evening with another car, before you know it, they have to go and report to the king. Oh, king, may God bless you. We have seen something strange. Suddenly, this man has changed. This man always begged for food before, but now God has blessed him. And we notice he started from the day you took that ark into his house. Amen. What happened? The king said, I must go and see him. I must go to his house. It cannot be possible. There's somebody in the house. This very week, this very month, this shall be your testimony in the name of Jesus. As you see somebody who is diligent in his work, he shall stand before king and not before me, men. Deuteronomy 8, 18, Psalm 84, verse 11, Daniel 5, verse 14. Lift up your hand. Say this very day, throughout this week, and beyond. Say, O Lord my God, say I declare, open heaven upon my business, upon my career. Say I declare, open heaven upon my business, upon all my transactions, in the name of Jesus. Open heaven, open heaven, open heaven. Say throughout this week, throughout this month, say I declare, open heaven upon my business, upon Plenty Goods Network, open heaven, in the name of Jesus, upon all my ministration this week, I declare open heaven, 
in the name of Jesus, upon all my prayer, upon all the intercession, I declare open heaven, in the name of Jesus, open heaven, 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 can we begin to decree and declare open heaven, let heaven open upon you, let heaven open upon the work of your hand, this very morning, in the name of Jesus, thank you mighty father, in Jesus' name, we are praying. When the heavens open upon you, when the heavens open upon the work of your hand, what is going to happen? The first thing that will happen is there will be release of deals of heaven. What is this deal of heaven? The blessings of heaven. The blessings of heaven. The blessings of heaven. Lift up your hand. Say in the name of Jesus. Say as heaven open upon my work. As heaven opened upon my business, say I call forth deals of blessing upon my work, deals of blessing upon my business, deals of blessing upon my career, deals of blessing upon praying goods network this week, this day, this month. In the name of Jesus, begin to call it forth deals of blessing upon the work of your hand. In the name of Jesus, deals of blessing, deals of blessing. Deals of blessing, deals of blessing, deals of blessing, the deals of heaven, the deals of blessing. Let it rest, let it come upon my ministry, upon the, my work, upon my career, or in the name of Jesus, upon all the transactions, upon all the transactions, upon all the business transactions that you'll be doing this week. So, Lord, my God, I call forth deals of blessing upon my work, deals of blessing upon my business. Deals of blessing upon my career. Deals of blessing upon my work. Deals of blessing upon my business. Deals of blessing. I call it forth. 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 Begin to call it forth. In the name of Jesus. Deals of blessing. 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 Say I call it forth. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say in the name of Jesus. Say this week, O oh Lord my God, favor my work, favor my business. In the name of Jesus. Say this very week, say, O oh Lord my God, favor the work of my hand, favor my business. In the name of Jesus. I want you to mention the name of that your business. Say, O oh Lord my God, this very week, favor my work, favor my business. Favor my work, favor my business, favor my work, the work of my hand. Oh Lord, my God, favor it, oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Favor my work, favor my business, 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 in the name of Jesus. Can you pray that prayer for yourself? Speak to the work of your hand. Your hand represents the work of your hand. Look at your hand. Say, oh Lord, my God, the work of my hand this week. The work of my hand this month. Oh Lord my God, favor it. 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 Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name we are praying. In Jesus' name we are praying. So let's go back to Psalm 90, verse 17. Say, let the beauty of the Lord, the favor of the Lord, the glory of the Lord, the honor of the Lord, let it come upon my world. And what will happen? Establish. Somebody say establish. Say that Lord will establish my work. Say that Lord will establish my business. Now lift up your hand. So Lord my God, say this very week, establish me, O Lord. Establish my work. Establish my business. Establish my career. This very week, this very day, oh Lord my God, by your favor, establish my work. Establish my business. Establish my career. My going out. My coming. All my transactions. All my proposal. Lord, Lord my God, establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Speak to that your work. Speak to your business. Ask the Lord God to establish your work, the work of your hand, your business, your career. Say, Father, establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Establish them. 
Establish them. Establish them. Establish them. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, you are established. Say this day, this week, say I reject error. I reject setback. I reject failure. I reject accident. Do you reject them? Do you reject those things? Say I reject debt. Now begin to reject. Anything you don't want to see, anything you don't want to witness in your business, begin to reject them. In the name of Jesus, I reject error. I reject setback. I reject failure. I reject accident. I reject unanswered prayer. In the name of Jesus, I reject sleepy breakthrough. I reject witchcraft attack. In the name of Jesus, fire accident. I reject it this week. In the name of Jesus, this day, I reject it. I reject the work of darkness. In the name of Jesus, thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. So, Lord, my God, raise men and women for the growth, for the increase of my business. It's a good prayer. When the glory of God come upon your business, and men and women, they begin to patronize you. You have men and women that will support you as staff. Before you know it, what will happen? Increase and enlargement. Increase and enlargement. But you need the right caliber of people. You need the right people. You need the right people that will work with you. So, and it is only God that can bring the right people to your step. Lift up your hand. So, Lord my God, say this week, say this month, say, Father, raise men and women for the growth, for the increase of my business, of my career, in the name of Jesus. Father, raise men and women for the increase, for the growth of this ministry, in the name of Jesus. Father, raise men and women for my business, for the growth of my business, for the increase of my business, as the Lord God to raise men and women for you, in the name of Jesus, for your business, for your career, for the growth of your business, for the increase of your business, for the enlargement of your business. Say, Father, raise men and women for me. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, Father, I can't hear you. So, Lord, my God, deliver my business from works of darkness. In the name of Jesus. So, Lord, my God, this day, this week, deliver my business, deliver my career from every works of darkness, from agent of darkness. In the name of Jesus. Can you pray that prayer for yourself? Let the Lord God deliver you. Let God deliver your work from work of darkness, from agent of darkness. In the name of Jesus. As the Lord God to deliver you. As the Lord God to deliver your work and your business. In the name of Jesus. From the work of darkness. Let God deliver you. Let God deliver you. Let God deliver your work. Let God deliver your business. From the work of darkness. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say in the name of Jesus. Say this morning, I cancel, I abort, evil agenda, evil thought, evil imagination, evil dream, evil prophecy concerning my business. Say I abort them and I cancel them. I abort them and I cancel them. Evil thought, evil agenda, evil imagination, evil prophecy, evil dreams. He said, I cancel them and I abort them in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Say this week, say my business will prosper. My career will prosper. The work of my hand will prosper in the name of Jesus. This very week, my work will prosper. My business will prosper. The work of my hand will prosper. This very week, pray in the good network. You will prosper in the name of Jesus. Every members of this ministry, you will prosper. Your work will prosper. Your business will prosper. Your career will prosper. Your expectation will prosper in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Now, the last prayer before we share grace today. I want you to just lift up your hand and speak blessing into the work of your hand. Can you just desire what you want? He said, Tell the children of Israel, as they have said in my ear, so will I do unto them. Now pre- pro- prophesy into the work of your hand. What you want God to do for you, what you want God to do for your business, 
What you want to see, what you want God to bring to pass this week in that your business concerning your career, can you begin to prophesy it in the name of Jesus? In the next one minute, I want you to declare and declare concerning your work. What do you want to see? What do you want, you want God to do? Is there any penny issue? Is there any penny? Is there any difficult task? Ask the Lord God to solve them for you. The spirit of wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the Lord. Let it rest upon you for divine solution. Every problem, every issue in that business, receive divine solution. I want you to prophesy. Say it. Say, I receive divine solution. I receive divine solution. Whatever is the problem, whatever is the issue, begin to receive divine solution. Wisdom to manage crisis. Wisdom to manage pressure. Receive it. Receive wisdom. Receive wisdom. Ask God to open doors for you. Ask God to open doors for you. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Lift up your hand. I join my faith with your faith this morning. And together by faith, we speak into the work of our hand. That this day, the Lord will prosper the work of our hand in the name of Jesus. We declare open heaven upon the work of our hand. The deals of blessing will rest upon our heart, our work this week in the name of Jesus. The favor of God, the beauty of God shall rest upon the work of our hand in the name of Jesus. This week, the Lord will raise men and women for an increase and a large of our business in the name of Jesus. Every satanic agenda, every evil thought, every evil imagination concerning the work of our hand, the Lord abort it in the name of Jesus. The Lord will deliver the work of our hand from error in the name of Jesus. This week, your business will prosper. This week, the work of your hand will prosper. This week, the Lord will increase and enlarge you in the name of Jesus. Every pending issue, every crisis, the Lord will bring solution in the name of Jesus. As many of you that you need financial help, may God arise for you in the name of Jesus. May God bring men and women to help you out in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name, we are pray. Praise the Lord. Once again, you are welcome back from our short holiday. Amen. Now, our business my prosper begin every monday five o'clock nigeria time join me next week again by the grace of god for my business most prosper the lord bless us in the name of jesus as you go into this week may the favor of god rest upon you in the name of jesus amen let's not forget thursday hours of mercy friday communal service and friday weekly fiji the lord bless you all in jesus name praise the lord can we share the grace together as we go? Dear father, mother, uncle, auntie, married, single, boy, girl, man, woman, brother, sister, and friend, you and I will one day leave this world and our spirit will appear on the other side. Will you be allowed to enter heaven? The only way to enter heaven is to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and walk in righteousness. If you have not given your life to Jesus, or you once did, and you backslid it, you started living in sin, please say this prayer after me. Lord Jesus, I believe in my heart that you died for me, and on the third day you rose again, that I might be free from sin. Right now, I confess you as my Lord and personal Savior. Forgive me my sins, and wash me with your blood. Make me your child, and write my name in the book of life. Thank you, Jesus, for saving me, sin and Satan has no more power over my life in jesus mighty name it's a new day amen and amen god bless you